Um, understanding that we just got to be consistent in how we prepare every day. Um, practice, we got to have a full-on practice, be consistent throughout. Um, warm up, shoot around, all that type of stuff. I think that has an effect on the game. And if we do that, I think we'll come out and be a lot more prepared than we have been so far. Thanks, Kay. You guys seem to be more comfortable in that second half, especially offensively. Was it just more confidence when you see those shots go in or just the chemistry between you guys a little bit more? Um, I think it was the fact that in, this, in the first half, we were getting each other open looks. And once you get, I think we got a lot of good players on this team. So once you get good players, good looks, um, if they miss the first time, they're not going to miss the second time more often than not. So I think us staying consistent and um, trying to make plays for each other, I think that showed in the second half. How great was seeing defensively you guys kept that intensity at the end of the game, which is mm -hmm. you secured your win today? Um, that's big time. Um, defense like is big for us. We're going to play some high-level guards, high-level bigs throughout the whole year. So just being able to get stops in the, in the crunch time, I think that was big. Um, being able to communicate in these environments, the crowd helped us out a lot, so it was really good. Would you say this is the most assertive game you've seen from Scotty today? Um, I thought he picked his spots very well today. Um, I think he was a lead on both ends of the floor. Took the challenge of guarding one of the best guards in the, um, in their league. So um, he's a really crafty scorer. So, and he played with a calm confidence tonight. And I think he gave us a big lift on both ends. Was this sort of the response that you guys needed from the disappointment last weekend? Um, we would have liked to um, do a lot, a, a few things better. But I think that getting a win is always great. Understanding that it's going to be a challenge no matter who we play, where we play. And I think we grew a little bit tonight, and um, we got to continue to grow. I'm um, going on the road on Sunday. Do, do you think something, something clicks, something changed with the defense? Because I think it would, through 38 minutes, they're shooting 49%, and then they missed six of their last seven shots. Did you all just come together late, or, or what was going um, on there late? I think um, we underst understood the magnitude of the possession at that moment in time. Um, Understanding that we got to lock in, communicate. I think the crowd helped us a lot with that. Um, and then I think we had five guys out there who were locked in to get a stop. Understanding that it was one possession at a time, and we didn't want to end up on losing in back-to-back -back games. How would you assess Scotty? Big time, big time, <laughs> big time on both ends of the floor. Um, he played with, like I just told her. He mm -hmm. played with like a calm poise tonight, like calm confidence. I want to say. Um, and I think he gave us big plays on the defensive end, especially guarding one of the best players in their conference. Then helped us rebound down, helped us in transition, um, picked his spots when he wanted to drive and attack, get those guys in rotation, and kicked out when he had the opportunity to. How do you get out of that frustrating element where every time you guys have a chance to maybe stretch out the lead a little bit, uh -huh. they come out and hit a big shot? That's how it is. Um, that's how it is some nights. Um, we understand that. And I think our guys did a really good job of staying together throughout the whole process. Um, even when um, it was looking a little um, scarce for us on the offensive end, um, I thought guys um, were able to pick each other up when they saw somebody get down, and I think that's what we need. Thanks, Gary. Chemistry getting better three games in, um, four games with the exhibition. Yep, for sure. Um, I think that we're getting better. We're understanding how to pick our spots for ourselves and also make plays for each other, understanding that we can talk to each other. Um, if, hey, you missed me here. I, I got you. Um, I think that's big time. And I think that's um, how brothers grow and um, get better in these environments. Were you calling for the ball when it was 60 all, the basket you got inside? To, uh, um, yeah, um, go ahead coach had asked me, um, did I feel comfortable so. getting on the block? And I was like, for sure. Um, and my teammates found me, took my time. They didn't bring a double. I was able to get a quick score. I know you were focused on Towson before the game, but now it's a quick turnaround to mm -hmm. UConn. What type of challenges will that present for you guys? Um, it's a road environment, so that's big time. Um, two days to prepare for those guys. They're a really good team on both ends of the floor. And we understand that um, it's a big environment, big game for us, and we got to continue to grow. Thank you.